So now you know you're getting serious if he's putting his big boy pants on. These aren't my big boy pants. Oh. Yeah. I'm assuming are all must-have tools for, for building. Yeah, you don't need anything super special, although it helps to have maybe like a table saw or or something fancy, like planers and big stuff like that, but you don't need it. And the basics of what you'll need is a, is a decent circular saw. Hold it up closer, like to your chest. Thing you wanna know with uh, with the saw blades that you want, if you're doing the rough cuts, like the, the strapping and and like the boards and stuff like that. You can get it, you can get away with a blade that has less teeth because you're just doing rough cuts and then you can sand it down afterwards. If you're doing something like this, long, straight, kind of nice wood cuts, get one that has more teeth. So 40 teeth I think is, you can go higher but it's ridiculously expensive and I didn't really notice a huge difference between 40 and like whatever the next one up was. You'll save some money on saw blades if you go with like a 40 in bow. To nail up the paneling, I used a, a nailer. An 18 gauge brad nailer. So I used one and a quarter inch and one inch wherever I needed them. Cordless drills, like must. I don't know, I can't live without these things. So I have this one for drilling. And this one for screwing. Or vice versa, whatever you want. The two. Yeah. So then you can just keep your drilling bit on one drill and your Phillips or Robertson bit on the other drill. So if you can, grab something like this, this little clip here. The amazing part about this is if you're on like ladders or whatever, you just clip it in. Boom, you're good to go. And then you work away and then you can just grab it, go, zip, 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 and you're good to go. Clink, cool. To do finer cuts, more detailed things, a jigsaw. And then get the whatever blade you need for whatever job you need. Wood, wood blade for wood blades, metal blade for metal blade, etc., etc., etc. You can pick the brand that you want and go with an Iper from Milwaukee. They just kind of work. They're rock solid. They, they don't die on me. I love the flat batteries on these big battery packs. I think you can get 20 volts. You can get 24. I don't know what the thing is anymore, but 18 volts seem to do everything I need to do. This battery also works in my nailer. It works in my jigsaw, and it works in my, my circular saw. Cool. The other must-have, I think it's called a car carpenter square. This thing is a lifesaver. I did most of my stuff with this. Get yourself a good wrecking bar. They're solid. And then obviously a tape measure. So this one's cool. And if you can look in that, this one has both metric and um, imperial. I've used other tape measures. This is the best one I've ever used. This one is fast cap. I had another fast cap. The, uh, the locker on the other one, it broke. These guys have a lifetime warranty on the thing, so I gave them a call, they just shipped me a new one. So, other than that, get a crap ton of bits. Um, gorilla tape is a must. And then, you know, hammers, screwdrivers, etc. So get a good socket set. You're gonna use that for a number of things, not just the construction on the inside, but you're, if you're mechanically inclined, you'll use this to do your mechanical bits. So you can, this is actually a mechanic socket set, apparently. I've used almost every tool in here. Not every socket, but I've used every one of the tools in here for different things. Electrical too, for, for hooking up my panels and all that stuff. So Like when we used to own a house? No, I use this on the van. Every one oh. of these on the van. Last but not least, stand up. Your what? pants. Oh yeah, they're black ladder pants. You obviously don't need pants like this. I just like, because we have to minimize, so these pants have built-in tool belt, essentially is what it is. It's bloody magic. Like it's got your hammer, thing here, things here, put your, your other tools here, like this thing's magic. Pockets on this side, so. Talk about and then knee. this has built-in knee pads too. So you can get foamy ones or gel ones, whatever ones you want to do. They're removable, so if they go bad, you can do that. Um, you can just replace them. Yeah, love so. these pants. These pants are the bomb. Um, I wore this for almost all of the construction and they still look like they're brand new except for some paint and smudge marks. So, love these pants. So.